I'm playing Jenny. Jenny. And Jenny is a character that kind of changes in the movie, right? Yes. I go from, well, there's a bunch of characters that kind of are in the past, in the 90s. Mm -hmm. We're young and like 17, and then, you know, when we're older, when we're like 38. So we kind of had to go through the whole prosthetic makeup, you know, wigs and all of that stuff, which was really cool. So in, in the beginning, or in the beginning, or I guess in the beginning of time, yes. you're, you're with Brian's character, and then you end up with Mark's character. Exactly. That's, uh, Mark was saying that's kind of a difficult role to play without being really mean about it. Exactly, yeah. It's, it, it's interesting because you don't want her to be like a bad person because she ends up with someone's best friend. But it was kind of like a weird circumstantial thing. He ends up getting hurt in high school, and you know that at the beginning of the movie. And um, we sort of talked about the fact that he probably kind of pushed me away, and I went off to college, and then ended up later on with his best friend. So, you know, and you know that at the very beginning of the movie. So when he goes back in time and gets to try it all over again, we're together again, and I'm the girl that got away for him. So, anyway. And that kind of steers him towards rock bottom, right? Exactly, it does. It totally steers him towards rock bottom, and just kind of makes him reflect and think about like what his fa who, the family that he has and how happy he actually is or does he want to be with me so yeah um, so the scenes that are going on tonight what are we seeing mm -hmm. um, tonight we're actually doing the big end like football game of when you're back in the past um, it's the redo of the football game all over again where Brian's character gets hurt and he gets to make a choice of doing a different play so he doesn't get hurt this time so he can become a pro and be married to me and all of these things. So this is the big, it's like the exciting night for us. It's the big night. Tonight and tomorrow night is what we're shooting. And we got we got a bunch of local fans in the stands and yeah, you get to cheer them on, right? We do. We got a ton of local fans tonight. It's so cool. It's just amazing the outpouring from um, this awesome little town. And I grew up in a small town, so it's cool. It's, it would be so weird for me as a child to have a movie filming in my backyard. You know what I mean? I'd be like, what is going on? So yeah, it's cool. I love had, it. Have you had a chance to check out the area at all? I have. I actually went to a restaurant called the Winchester, okay. and it was amazing. The food is awesome, and nice. you know we live in LA, so there's tons of great food. But that place rocks. I love it. Nice. Anything else you've been able to get out and do? I um, went to Reed's Lake and to uh, is it Aquinas College? Uh -huh. Yeah, I went there, ran around, and. Um, a bunch of restaurants. We've had everything. Trichogini, the Chop House, you know, all that good stuff. Um, Pop Cat. <laughs> a lot of places downtown. And then we drove around Coopersville. I mean, it's beautiful farmland. So. Is this your first time in Michigan? Um, this is not my first time in Michigan. I actually used to come up to Benton Harbor, Michigan. So, this is a cute little town. Do you have a question? On the tape.